Well, as you know, Bluebird has been a full line product supplier for over 80 plus years. And our emphasis in the marketplace has historically been, because market volume driven, has been the big bus model C and D. Even though we've been in the micro business for a long time, we saw a need to improve on the product. And we had a choice to make. We could invest substantial resources and talent of our team uh, to overhaul the product, if you will, or seek a partnership. We have a relationship with uh, the Girardin family for many years. We know they're a high quality, not only professional group of individuals, but also from a product perspective. And so when we analyzed the potential return on investment, it made a lot of sense for both companies to join hands and uh, take the synergies that both companies have to the customer level. We believe that as a result of the merger, we not only will benefit internally from uh, cost-effective production, but uh, also share with, with the customers our ability to produce a high-quality product with a strong brand equity. As far as we're concerned, we, we, uh, we had a strong belief in the Bluebird brand, and we also believe that the Bluebird dealer network is a very strong dealer network, and uh, we felt there was a perfect marriage uh, for the both of us. Basically, it's a win-win situation, and we're very pleased with that. So. We, as a corporation, as the Girardin Group, committed to the green strategy. Our view of the marketplace segment, the type A business, is that it's a, a smaller segment on a percentage of our build, and as a result, the investment required is being evaluated to determine if the volume opportunity is there for us to pursue that market. We know we have competitors in that space, and our objective is to be a full service supplier to our customers, and so as a result, we're giving consideration to that product, introducing a propane product in the, in the type A marketplace, but as of to date, we've not made a firm decision. We're, we're considering different alternatives, uh, diesel hybrid, propane, CNG. With the recent uh, joint venture with Bluebird, uh, propane seems to make sense, and it would, seem, it would make sense as a company direction to follow suit with that, but we're, we're still going to be analyzing that over the next few weeks and taking the decision uh, over which direction we take. The co-op is a significant benefit to Bluebird in that we see production efficiencies as, as a major benefit of this merger relationship. Uh, as the industry is aware, we used to have a separate production facility for the Type A microbird product. We closed that plant a couple of years ago and moved that product into Fort Valley, Georgia. Being very candid, the synergies that we were expecting from a production standpoint did not materialize. So as a result, the complexity we have in our Fort Valley facility where the microbird is currently built is, uh, is, is a concern to us from the standpoint of we always want to produce the maximum quality product. We have that in the big bus line today and we were not manufacturing in a sufficient volume to uh, support the investment required to take the small bus to the next level. Our relationship with Girardin has given the opportunity of the synergies between the two company with their technology expertise and long successful history of building a type A product. We see this as a win-win for both our teams but also for the customer. Girardin benefits from, from having a, a, a captive dealer network uh, of Bluebird dealers and we, we feel it's the best dealer network uh, for school buses out there. So we strongly believe in that. We strongly believe in the Bluebird brand, like I said earlier. For, fortunately, there, there's a big market for gas. Uh, uh, quite a bit of our demand is uh, gas units. So we, uh, we feel that there will be a minimal impact. But as far as we're concerned, the dealers have already pre-ordered uh, significant quantities of diesel engines. And uh, basically, the, the uh, as far as we know today, GM will be starting back up. Their order bank will be opening in April 2010, so we anticipate making school delivery with new emission diesel vehicles from GM.
In my opinion, the market segment is a small enough space that I doubt that this will generate a new competitor. But in, in a global marketplace, there are substantial funds available through other worldwide manufacturers who have uh, covet for the North American market. So it's possible, but I think it's unlikely based upon the investment required for a small market. There's always an opportunity for a new competitor and particularly large global players that have excess capacity seeking new market opportunities. It, it wouldn't surprise me, on the other hand, uh, the, the cost of entry is very high and especially in a decreasing marketplace. And we're seeing volumes this year off as much as 30% compared to historic sales. I think it'll be difficult to, uh, to enter the market. There, it's already a very congested market. At the moment, uh, you never know what different companies will do or how they want to spend their money. Uh, but th the number of players in the market and the size of the market will make it very difficult. Not only that, there's a, there's a very heavy uh, product uh, technicalities and especially regulatory complexity that comes with the school bus that will make a, a difficult barrier of entry uh, into the market segment. One of the synergies of the merger between the Girardin organization and Bluebird has been our ability to free up production capacity in Fort Valley, Georgia. We've now will focus on concentrating on large bus, our vision, the conventional model and transit bus, uh, the D model bus. And as a result, we think we'll uh, ensure our capability of continuing to produce high quality uh, product having less complexity on the production floor where we were traditionally running three models. Uh, the Bluebird brand for us stands for quality and durability of the products and uh, basically by merging the two together we'll, we'll be able to exploit different strategies for, and synergies for product technologies uh, and what have you to ensure that the customers always get the quality and dependability they've come to expect from Bluebird and from Girardin over the years. This is a joint venture partnership. Uh, the Girardin brand is uh, scheduled to phase out within the next 12 months uh, in favor of the Bluebird Microbird by Girardin brand. That's the uh, intent and the basis for the JV and, and it's, uh, we feel it's going to have very positive ramifications for, for us as a company, Bluebird, and its dealers and the customers.